God Como gave me. And as I promised, we're here. In the cemetery where all the poor souls come to rest. After all, the fatalities. And we're here to do this special unboxing of both versions of Mortal Kombat X, baby. Oh yeah. Mortal Kombat changed my life. Ed Boon, I swear to God, if I see you in the street, I will so rape you and have your kid because... Ugh. Anyway, I digress. Let's start with the course edition of Mortal Kombat X, shall we? And what do you expect when you open this gorgeous box of Mortal Kombat X? What else? Mortal Kombat X in the flesh, if you will. And the cool thing about this collector's edition is that it has the combat pack and boy I can't tell you how excited I am because of the combat pack because it has Jason Voorhees, Tanya from Mortal Kombat 4, Tremor and guess what Predator yes oh my god this is so freaking cool this only happens with Netherrealm Studios I don't know what's the deal with these guys but they keep giving us great awesome content with the fighter I wish, I wish that Freddy Krueger was in this game so we can finally play Freddy vs. Jason on a video game. <laughs> the other thing is that it has the samurai pipe. There's skins, like the name says, samurai skins, for Kitana, Kenshi, and Shinnok. The other piece of DLC is that we can play as Goro. Yes, the four-armed bastard, man, Goro. I am master of combat. Goro's been awesome since the first time I saw him on Mortal Kombat 1 and uh, we've been able to play him in Mortal Kombat Trilogy and Mortal Kombat Armageddon. Goro wins. Fatality. And as always, this is my favorite part of the collector's edition. And remember, this is the course edition and we have the statue. The statue of our poster boy, Scorpion. I gotta say one thing, and don't get me wrong, this is my opinion. And you know what they say about opinions. Opinions are like assholes. Everybody has one. So anyway, here I go. This is not my favorite statue. I know I know they work hard on it, but hey, it's personal taste. And you know what? It reminds me of Batman the Animated Series. And I have nothing against Batman, okay? Especially the Animated Series. It's freaking awesome. It's amazing. But as you can see, uh, it looks kind of like a cartoon. And I don't know, I don't think it goes well with the Mortal Kombat theme. Uh, but you can see the details like the edges, you know, the lines of the of the hood, its back, uh, the arms and everything. If you like this Batman animated Scorpion, guess what? It also has the DLC for this skin. So Scorpion can, you know, be animated and stuff. They're also selling a Sub-Zero animated Batman, whatever, but that doesn't include this, you have to buy one. So anyway, uh, like I was saying, here we have a card that gives us the certificate of validation, ownership, whatever. I'm making this up right now and it's signed by the creators of this particular statue that is seven like the movie Wachowski okay that's not the real name we're gonna put the names right here because really I'm sorry I'm butchering the name but I can't pronounce it okay so be my guest if you want to do it the other guy is Mark Lander well I don't know I'm gonna put the name so anyway uh, kudos to those guys I know this is a hard work but like I said my opinion anyway let's move on here we are 
the big one, the collector's edition with K, because everything has to be with K with Mortal Kombat X. And we have the game, of course, but we also have this sexy steelbook. And it's all Scorpion, because that's Ed Boon's favorite. And that's my favorite too, because I like fire, baby. Burn, baby, burn. It also has the combat pack, like I said, it has Jason, Tanya, Tremor, and Predator. It has the DLC with Goro, the Samurai pack. It also has the weird animated Batman whatever Scorpion. Let's see what else can we find inside this bad boy. We have here this awesome comic book. The comic book is published and it's done by none other than DC Friggin' Comics. And the cool thing about this is that it prepares you for the story mode in Mortal Kombat. You know, some stuff like, I'm not gonna spoil you, but you wanna know how Sub-Zero got his scar, because yeah, that changed since Mortal Kombat 3. And I'm not gonna give anything away, but like I said, everything is inside this bad boy right here. The other thing, oh, and get ready guys. Ooh, yeah. I got it, got this humongous statue. And this is my, this is my favorite one. We have here, Scorpion. Yeah, what were you expecting, Sub-Zero? I don't know why, but what do you have against Sub-Zero, Ed Boon? But anyway, Scorpion, here it is. It's pretty cool. I like this one better than the course collection because I love the details. Scorpion looks, you know, he, he looks real. He looks badass. You can see the skulls. Uh, there's the rib cage right there. It reminds me of Mortal Kombat, you know, three when you punch the guy and like three rib cages came flying and you know exploding and stuff. But anyway, I digress. It has the Mortal Kombat logo, and this is my favorite one. And to prove that we have earned our collector's edition, we have our little card here that give us that certificate of validation of ownership, and I'm making this up. But, you know, something like that. It's, I am number 2,119 of 70,000. Yes, they made 70,000 of these. You know, I'm curious if your number, you know, one through 10, I would like to know. So I don't know, tweet me or, you know, contact me on ICQ and leave your comments, whatever. But wait, Carcamo, I wanted the weird Scorpion animated skin. So I have to get both versions? No, that skin comes with this collector's edition too. So you can have the best of both worlds. So stop complaining. And now my final thoughts. What do I think of both versions? Well, like I said, the course version, it's obviously it's cheaper, but it doesn't have the steel book. Uh, it has the combat pack, the samurai pack. It has the weird scorpion skin. It has the core statue and it doesn't have the comic. Now this one, this, it's the way to go, baby. This is the one that I would choose if I had to buy one. It has all the things that I mentioned previously, and it has the comic book, the steel book, this awesome Scorpion statue. And if you have to have both, and if you're a sicko, and you wanna waste your money, and you wanna be bankrupt, like someone I know, not, not, not me, not me. So anyway, if you wanna do that, then get both, I guess. So. What do you guys think? Which one did you get? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. This was Carcamo Gaming. And remember, like or die.